So maji makundi yanayozozana Sudan Kusini yameazimia kurejelea mazungumzo jijini Nairobi kama sehemu ya kukomesha ghasia zinazokumba taifa hilo. Makubaliano hayo yalifikiwa wakati wa mkutano wa mfumo wa amani kwa jina Tumaini katika kati ya Rais William Ruto, mwenzake wa Sudan Kusini Salva Kiir na naibu rais wa kwanza Ruyek Machar ulioandaliwa mjini Juba. Kwenye kikao cha pamoja na wanahabari kilichohudhuriwa na waziri wa masuala ya nchi za kigeni wa Sudan Kusini Chola Jang na mshauri wa Rais William Ruto kuhusu masuala ya usalama wa kitaifa Monica Juma ilibainika kwamba pande husika zimeafikiana kuhusu masuala tisa. Ili kukamilisha mfumo huo, marais hao waliagiza wajumbe wa mashauriano hayo kukongamana jijini Nairobi na kutafuta jawabu kwa masuala mawili yaliyosalia katika muda wa wiki mbili zijazo. His Excellency President Republic of Kenya was honored to host a negotiation between the Artigono and Holsart group to the Arts Access Peace Agreement. The heads of state agreed to secure regional endorsement of the Tumaini initiative and to urge IGAD to mobilize resources and goodwill of the international community including the Troika and other countries to enable full implementation of the initiative. Rais Ruto alisema inaridhisha kuona swinto fahamu zilizokuwepo baina ya serikali na makundi ya wapiganaji wakiwemo viongozi wa upinzani zikitatuliwa katika hatua itakayohitimisha mapigano ya takriban miaka mitano na kurejesha utulivu nchini humo. The two head of states commended the constructive dialogue among the diverse parties to, to initiate towards a tangible outcome. Hali kadhalika viongozi hao waligusia uhusiano uliopo baina ya Kenya na Sudan Kusini wakiutaja kuwa wa kihistoria na unaopaswa kudumishwa. On infrastructure and particularly the construction of the 11 km Nanda Pal to Nakadok road, the two heads of state noted that it is a vital cross-border infrastructure crucial for enhancing trade and movement between our two countries. The road will not only benefit our economies but also strengthen the ties between our two countries. Give us in mind, Kurunzi Mashinari.